Okay, I'm going to have a go at the Guardian's cryptic crossword for Monday, December 4th. One across. Some reached a cafe back our front. So the sum indicates maybe a hidden clue. We take some of these letters in the back. We have to read backwards. So from the F in cafe backwards, we have facade. Oops, let's do one across. All right, let's try one down. Lover embraces wife, a timid little creature. So wife is W. Maybe we have to put a word for lover. Uh, should I get a word for lover? Put a W in it. And we do have a little A there. Uh, is that part of it? Timid little creature. Uh, but what's a short word for lover, beginning with F? Well, fan, maybe? Around W, fawn. I suppose, yeah, fawns are um, timid. Craftily obtain fish by weight. Well, we do have the W for weight. And then a fish, and then craftily. Oh, I should. Yeah, I think there's a word at the back of my mind for craftiness, beginning with W, but it's not coming to me. All right, let's try two down. Criminal changed course, we're told, so a homophone, I suppose. That's touching. So, I presume touching is the definition, which could be moving, but it could also be literally touching. What's a short word for a criminal and then something that sounds like changed course? So, uh, swerved, steered, Change zigzagged, um, no. Supply, extremely durable, uniform. Uniform can be U in the uh, NATO phonetic alphabet. Um, but then again, extremely durable could be the D and the E of um, durable. So I'm wondering if it's then a six letter word for uniform. And the whole thing means supply. No, not getting that. Where one shifts stuff from the estate. Well, this uh, is an English expression. And then, in fact, an estate, uh, I think, is a station wagon, right? With some model of car which would have a boot. And so a car boot sale is where you might shift stuff from the estate. Uh, ruined by whiskey, question mark, eight letters, second is C. Ruined, um, scarred is too short. And by whiskey, hmm, not getting that. Worried being stupidly bold, true. Um, we have two four-letter words beside each other with stupidly possibly telling us to anagram them. Um, and I presume it would end in ed. We still have a, uh, oh, troubled would be worried. Um, 
one that uses all the letters of bold true. In Vulcan's gob, an amazing drink. Well, those words are so strange. This has to be an anagram. We're looking for 16 letters. In Vulcan's is nine. And then, um, sorry, we're looking for 14 letters. In Vulcan's nine. Gauban brings us up to the 14. So an anagram of this meaning a drink. Just looking for a good five letter word. It might be at the back of this. No, nothing. I think I need a few more letters. Uh, Non-stop talker on car journey. Question mark. Uh, prattler, uh, witterer. So it could be non-stop as the definition. No. Excess muscle trimmed. So could it just be that word muscle after trimming some of the letters? No. I can't see that, or a specific muscle that you shorten. Well, what's a word for excess? No. Steal half this short distance. Well, I'm thinking um, to pinch something ends in inch and cockney rhyming slang don't they say half inch for pinch i think they do so i'm going to go with this and we'll see if the crossing letters agree with it a way to get goods in proper condition under protective cover eight way goods in proper condition under protect yeah that's a tough one to decipher i'm thinking for protective cover something like rain not rain coats Rain something. Oh, how about 17 down? One will change. Um, I'm thinking maybe like a cashier might change money or a uh, yeah, um, no, not, not too sure about that. And then maybe inch isn't right and it doesn't begin with C. All right, I didn't look for uh, some of the other downs that used uh, troubled. So let's try. These are up for approval, exclamation. Oh, I didn't look at the, uh... oh, I... I should have seen that Vulcan was the setter. So maybe it's not anagramming that and we have to um, we have to use I or me or my instead. Uh, so no wonder it looks so weird, but I still I think it just may happen to have uh, his or her pseudonym. Anyway, we'll come back to that. These are up for approval. Well, oh, thumbs. So that explains the exclamation. 
There's no wordplay here, it's just a punning definition that when thumbs are up, people approve. Oh, so now ruined by whiskey is obviously uh, scotched, and it is the uh, scotch spelling of whiskey. Don't drop anything in bag. I think that's another sort of punning uh, definition, a hold all. Um, and then single-minded cadet died in explosion. So that sounds like a, an anagram of cadet died. And with the D something, D has to be dedicated, right? Now our excess muscle trimmed. Um, a lat is a muscle, isn't a lateral? But um, what else could it be? Excess? Maybe a lot. I think a lot can be one word, but does it mean excess? I don't think so. Well, maybe the whole thing means trimmed. No, not getting that. Our uh, drink now has a very interesting ending. Ah, uh, so it must be a white wine. And uh, surely Sauvignon. Can I smell it? I think I can. All right, so Vulcans, in Vulcans, Gob, and yeah, that looks... I'm not going to stop and check it. It has to be right, surely. That gives us a very useful V for three down. Supply, extremely durable, uniform. Um, oh, yes. Um, I was trying to make delivers work but since this is supply it couldn't be delivers but then of course uh, livery delivery so it is the extremes of durable giving us de and then the uniform uh, somewhere it could be their livery now craftily obtain fish by weight i think it has to end in L Y, right? Craftily. Not warily, but wait. I think it'd just be W. I've also seen W T, but and then fish by that. Um, so what's a fish ending in L Y? Well, maybe that's wrong. Criminal changed course. That's touching. No, nope, not getting that. All right, where did I leave off? Not obstructed, but having picnic stolen? Question mark. This might be another punning definition having picnic stolen but also meaning not obstructed un I can see un something then might also suggest you've had something removed from you un unhampered yes that's a that is a, a good a good one, I like that. All right, oh, 12 down. Should definitely use that. Disturbance of ocean may make gulls wonder. Well, five and six makes 11, so anagram of gulls wonder and disturbance of ocean. Sure. 
that here. That should be very easy. But uh, nothing is coming to me. Let's try. Okay, I pause there to drink some water. Um, groundswell comes to mind. But um, I wouldn't have thought that was a disturbance of the ocean. I mean, I only know the word metaphorically. But um, I'll have to check that. Uh, that was our protective cover. Let's look at this one. You're blind. So no fantastic get-together. Well, that seems a bit insensitive. Um, but three, four, seven. So no fantastic get-together. No, nothing uh, is coming to me. Area of ship, I presume that's the definition. Shortly burning coal as winter starts. Well, that would be a W. Area of ship. Could it end in EW? And then what's shortly burning coal? No, not getting that. A piece of silk I monopolize for garment. Okay, we have another hidden clue here. Again, when you see these strange words like silk I monopolize, you th should be thinking anagram or hidden. Uh, so kimono, starting at the K. Uh, does that help us? Unprofitable land, space that's taken up. might mean unprofitable land, uh, but I'm not sure what a short word for that would be. And then a word for space that's written backwards. Uh, not getting it. One may be burning to start attacking the enemy. We have some good letters there. Something P, one may be burning to start attacking. Could be the A from attacking. And then. Oh, I'm, I'm thinking the definition may be one may be burning and it could be something fire. To start attacking the enemy. What's the opposite of hold fire? I think unhampered has to be right. Uh, so open fire, of course. An open fire. Uh, so it's a double, just simply a double definition. Okay, uh, 19 down. Completely destroy. Way of escape by the sound of it. Um, ah, yes, I think to completely destroy something is to root out. And it sounds like your way of escape, your root out. Doesn't work with the American pronunciation, of course. Criminal, three, packing a gun, 
once in America. Ah, yes, so it's um, criminal is an anagram indicator of the word three, and then you pack an A inside it, and you get an old slang term for a gun, heater. So now our unprofitable land space that's taken up begins, which I ends in R, so maybe the space. Well, room would be space, and that backwards is moor. Does that mean unprofitable land? I'm going to pause and uh, look up the definition of moor to see if there's a new definition that I don't know about. Oh, yeah, of course, that moor is uh, land. Um, the moors of England. How could I just, yeah, seeing it out of context like that through me i suppose i never really knew the definition i always thought it was just um a word for land fields rolling land but apparently it is an expanse of open rolling infertile land yeah art that is peaty and dominated by grasses and sedges yeah so i suppose i should have known that all right um not doing too badly, uh, I suppose, but this I think is going to be where I start to slow down. Um, where next? Sweet Roland informally at old college. Oh, I think it might be a um. A type of a sweet or dessert. Not a, a Swiss roll, but a something roll. Um, could it be an eaten roll? I know there's eaten mess. Could it be? And if would eaten be clued as old college? Let me uh, pause and search that one. All right, well, I do confess I resorted to a list of British desserts, and of course I should have known a roly-poly. So um, often a jam roly-poly. I think we bought the the, the shop one, um, Swiss roll, but I think it's the same thing. So Roland informally would be roly, and then uh, a poly, polytechnic, is a college. Um... Is it the old college because they no longer call them polys? Uh, could be. All right, so now our one will change ends in an L. One will change. No. Oh, I haven't looked at this one. Class out of bed to prepare for parade. It must be something up. So out of bed is up. And so what? It has to be a word for class. And it means to prepare for parade. So I presume it's a military term. Step up, mess up, um, no, not getting it. Uh, we have a few more letters, but they're not very helpful for our You're Blind. Although for the last seven letter word, something E, something N, something O, something, a get together. No, not getting that. Um, now our underprotective cover. A way to get goods. In proper condition. 
under protective. No. Well, what if 13 across started with R, non-stop talker and car journey? But question marks, I think this is going to be another punning or double definition, but with maybe a bit of uh, leeway allowed. Nonstop talker, car journey. Oh, a motor mouth, of course. So, uh, yeah. Pretty much what I expected. Now, so this then begins with M, a way to get goods. Oh, that could be mail order. So proper condition. Oh, I suppose chain mail is protective cover. And then proper condition, things are in order, I suppose. Now our area of the ship, let me get rid of that W begins with D, shortly burning coal as winter starts. A deck of some kind. No, not getting that, but um, now you're blind begins with O out one hour yes there word play here i don't i think this is just going to be one of those where it's sort of punning definition of you're blind but then it yeah no, not getting it. Yeah, the bottom left, very close. Um, I have all of the top right except for the excess muscle trimmed. No, I mean, there's not too many words that are going to fit in there. I will pause here, sip my water, and think about what vowel would come in the third position. Ah, okay, it didn't take me to, I was actually thinking of A's, and I said to in my mind, glut, and then I thought, oh, glut. So a glut, I think, is excess, and it's the, uh, what's it, the glutamus maximus, your glutes. All right. So that's the top right done. Criminal changed course. Oh, touching could be contact. And so a con, of course, I should have thought of as a short word for a criminal. And then uh, tact sounds like T-A-C-K-E-D. All right, so now craftily obtain fish. By weight, I should definitely should be able to get this one. Um, yeah, it has to be a vowel coming after the W. Oh, there's some slang term that is just eluding me. Yeah, I'm not getting that. I'm going to pause and uh, think about it again. Ah, yes, of course, the Y is wrong. As soon as I uh, hit pause, I thought of a uh, wangle. So to craftily obtain something uh, is to wangle it. And what gave it to me was uh, looking at um, an A starting it, I thought of angle as a way to obtain fish. By the W, Wangle. All right, so now it's just these uh, ones down in the bottom left, including the You're Blind. 
so no fantastic get together and could it be I'm thinking this might be a word ending in SS like miss if you're not having a get together you're going to miss them or could it be kiss uh, one less something and then what can this seven letter word be what comes between the n and the o could be another n could be a y could be a i yeah getting it. Um, yeah, let me, um, I'm going to resort to finding uh, military terms for preparing for a parade uh, and see what that gives me. All right, yeah, I suppose I sh should have got it from class, although of course there's so many different meanings. I was actually thinking of class as in a uh, a genera or some group of things, a class, but it's a school class and form, and so I suppose the order given to soldiers is form up. So now, could this be OSS? Yeah, I'm going to pause again and think about that. No, nothing is uh, coming to me, so I think I'm going to um, give up on the final one, two, three, and then we will check what I put in already. So yeah, let's uh, solve this one, reveal it. Old Boys Reunion. Ah, it was an anagram of um, you're blind, so no. And that is fantastic. And I did not see fantastic as a, a anagram indicator. And so the get together is an old boys reunion. Okay, so does that help me with one will change? It does. Um, I think it's mainly from reading... Agatha Christie whodunits where often there's a will and the codicil. I don't think I've ever heard the words said out loud, but um, codicil or codicil is a change to the will. And now area of ship. Oh, well, I was thinking of December which I'm pretty sure it is. I was really, um, yeah, so it's an area of the ship is a deck, but it's shortly because you drop the final letter and then a burning coal is an ember and as winter starts is December. All right, so let's go ahead and check all, see if I have any mistakes. Um, no, it looks like all of the letters are correct. All right, well, that is Monday. Let's see what they are saying. Oh, the uh, Guardian crossword editor is retiring, but it looks like the first says very enjoyable after a miserable week last, yeah, last week. All right, so um, not too bad today. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day.